believe that there's amazing talent around the world that's not getting seen. What we hope to do is try and change that. My name is Fabian and I'm the founder and creative director of Future Shorts, as well as Future Cinema that runs Secret Cinema. We set up in 2003 and uh, it started off as a one screening and uh, we've now turned it into a network of small film festivals around the world. I was a filmmaker making short films and I was working for a production company and felt that there wasn't enough of a platform for short films. You could only really see them at, on the tail end of film festivals or the tail end of Channel 4 at like 2 o'clock in the morning. So it dawned on me that there was this massive opportunity to uncover this talent that doesn't seem to get above this line that's been created by the film industry in which you know you have to be able to get a BAFTA or you have to get an award at Edinburgh to be able to get above and there's only a very few amount of people that decide what that talent is. What I'm interested in is the idea is that we don't decide what the talent is, it's the 100,000 people who are on our network who decide. They decide which talent because essentially they are the audience. From the first screening, which we did in this little bar called Ginglick underneath Shepherd's Bush, we had 120 people, we shared a programme of short films, and then we had a DJ play afterwards. And from that first screening, it's this sense of a social event that really, I think, people loved. I think people loved the idea of being relaxed, being able to have a drink and a smoke in those days, and watch you know, a group of films and then talk about the films and then perhaps meet some of the filmmakers. And, you know, it's like, I guess, a, what cinema used to be. But essentially it's all about the idea of cinema as a community, as a communal experience, as a place in which you know, people can be inspired. I don't know if it's just in this country, but the idea of ambition and the idea of living your dream and uh, doing the thing that you really want to do, people kind of look at you and go, you're just too ambitious. You know, why are you doing this? World domination, what's it about? It's like, well, we only, we're only here to do what we do. The power of dreams means to me that essentially you follow your dream you lose yourself in what you're doing and you love what you're doing and you never stop. Keep pushing it and keep doing what you do. And I believe you know, that you should follow your dream, you should do what you want to do.